Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am Timmy Trico, also known as Horror Fan for Life. And my final movie review today is Dead Tone. This movie was released on May 16, 2007. It is a slasher film that has a 4.6 out of 10 on IMDb and an 88% on Google. Uh, the movie was written and directed by Brian Hooks and Dion Taylor. And it stars Brian Hooks. Antoine Tanner, Sherry Johnson, Amy Garcia, Judd Tyler, and Rucker Hauer. And this movie is about a group of kids who have a sleepover when they're um, around between 8 and 10 years old. And their parents are also there at the house uh, drinking and having a party. The kids decide to get together and play this game called 75 where you make a prank call. And you got to have that uh, caller stay on the phone with you for at least 75 seconds and convince them of what you are talking about is on the up and up, basically. Uh, in doing so, um, they come across this caller um, who calls back later in the evening. And all of a sudden, uh, the parents are ambushed by this uh, axe-wielding maniac. <clears throat> and then... Um, all the kids that were there are left without parents and so they're all shipped off to either foster homes uh, or foster care or adopted and fast forward 10 years later we have these uh, those kids who basically survived that night um, are starting to be picked off one by one so these two officers are trying to track all these kids down in the meanwhile, the crew is what they call the group of friends, uh, decide to get together and have this party out in the middle of nowhere at this rich kid's house. And while they're there, they suggest playing the game uh, 75 seconds or 75. And you all pretty much know what's going to happen. Um, they get a caller on the line. Uh, and on that line, we hear him actually torturing one of the uh, party guests. Uh, and so he keeps calling back throughout the night, but they just ignore him uh, and just continue to party. But as people start to leave, uh, this is when the fun starts to happen. Uh, some of the kills in this movie are really good. I, I actually enjoyed it. Uh, I, I like the premise. I, I like what they're going for here. Uh, the fact that they're playing this game uh, is what's drawing this guy uh, out. But I, I like the fact that we actually got uh, a little bit of a twist ending in this movie. Something I did not see coming uh, whatsoever. Uh, but it's actually pretty genius in a way. Uh, I like what they did. Um, not that we haven't seen that type of twist before. We have, but I had no idea that it was coming. And, uh, yeah, I, I enjoyed this movie. I had fun with it. Uh, although this movie was censored uh, for some reason, I don't know why. Um, they didn't show any nudity. And they uh, uh, beeped out the cursing. But... That didn't make uh, make the movie for me. I mean, you see boobs, you hear cussing all the time. No big deal. Uh, but as far as the movie goes, I enjoyed it. I had fun with it. And, uh, I mean, you can't really take it seriously. If you do, you're going to be really disappointed. Uh, but I think this is a fun slasher. Um, and like I said, we, we've had many slashers that deal with uh, the telephone you know, when a stranger calls, you know, we, we've seen it many times over. But uh, I liked this one. They had a little fun with it. And uh, like I said, I did enjoy the twist ending. Um, and the way it ended, I thought was pretty cool. Don't know if we have any sequels to this. I highly doubt it. Uh, I don't know what the box office numbers were. Uh, there's no budget listed. But as I said for the previous movies, it's probably a minuscule budget uh, for these films. Um, but, 
I enjoyed it for what it is. It's not a perfect movie, no, but I enjoyed it. I love slasher movies, and uh, yeah, I enjoy this one. So I will give Dead Tone an 8 out of 10, and uh, yeah, definitely check this one out. Uh, it's a lot of fun. Uh, you can find this one on YouTube along with the rest of the movies I reviewed today as well. Uh, like I said, they're free. Give them a look see, even if you just watch them one time. You know, what the hell? So in the comment section below, if you've seen this movie, give me your thoughts and opinions. And um, what are some of your other favorite slasher movies that you have found on YouTube? On YouTube exclusively. Um, I don't want the movies that have just been downloaded on YouTube and that are one of those, uh, like, like Hellraiser or the big, big, you know, the big three. Or any, uh, movies like that. I want an actual movie that was uh, made and just put on YouTube. It didn't cost anything. You know, and a lot of indie movies uh, are on here. So give me some of your favorite uh, slasher movies on YouTube uh, that don't involve, like I said, the big three or, you know, a lot of those uh, franchises. But other than that, I thank you guys for watching yet another movie review. If you're new to the channel, subscribe today for more content. If you like this review, hit that like button and share this video on your social media as you see fit to. Um, and if you're looking for some uh, great music to listen to, check out my father's channel, Bill Treacle, and he does his own uh, videos and original mu uh, music as well. And you can check him out on Drupal as well. Uh, just look for Bill Treacle. Uh, other than that, I thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned for many more movie reviews, TV show reviews, trailer reviews, top tens, and rankings. If you have any ideas for uh, any videos you want me uh, to do on my channel, let me know in the comment section below, and I will definitely do those for you guys. And don't forget, once I reach 100 subscribers, I will do a live Q&A, so you guys can ask me all the questions you want about myself or my channel. Um, other than that, I thank you for watching and check you later.